Tails, great on cats, not so great for airless paint spray. My name is Darren and this is another video in the Airless Counter Airless Tips Q&A series. Today we're going to look at how to resolve the problem of seeing tails in your spray pattern. So the most two common, reason why, uh, common reasons why this is happening is that there's not enough pressure or uh, your spray tip is worn. So, how do we solve this? Well, if your spray tip is worn, simply replace the spray tip. If there's not enough spray pressure, you're going to want to gradually increase the pressure until you start uh, noticing that the tails are disappearing. Uh, also, uh, if you're, you may be able to uh, thin the material that you're using, if that's possible. Depending on the uh, machine that you're using, you might be pushing uh, the machine to its uh, maximum capacity. In that case, you'll simply want to replace the spray tip that you're using currently with something with a smaller fan width. Uh, also, if you want to check the, uh, the filters, because if the delivery rate is being compromised, if the uh, paint traveling through the machine uh, is being blocked somewhere, you want to check the intake sieve, the manifold filter or the spray gun filter to make sure that nothing is clogging uh, the material coming through. Uh, lastly, uh, some of our, we get questions from our DIY, uh, DIY painters or those uh, painters using entry level machines and you might be finding that you are pushing your machine to its maximum capacity in which case unfortunately uh, you won't be able to resolve uh, the issue just by changing the tip for example you're going to have to uh, get a machine that will be better suited to the task at hand so that's for the materials that are a lot thicker uh, or for paints that are requiring a different tip size thank you so much for watching i hope that resolves uh, the issue that you're facing and if you have any more questions or queries you can just leave a comment below or you can contact us thank you so much